Hello, this is me, Glitchmaster Sonic, and today I am creating a Blender tutorial showing you how to use the add object function in Blender 3D. So first, let's open up Blender, of course. And you see the default cube here. We want to press X and erase that. And now hit space, add, and go down here to empty. And there we have our empty. And do you see if you see these little tabs down here, go to the one that's second to the right of the one you're already on. And go ahead and add an icosphere or ICOs and put the subdivision on one. Otherwise, if you don't do that, your computer might freeze because it would be too high poly and there'd be so many of them and yeah I had that problem before but we're not gonna do that this time now go to game to the logic button set on no collision add a sensor controller and actuator the sensor being always the controller being in and the actuator being motion and the, the location, the, to the farthest to the left on location, put that on point two zero, and size this down, and press P to play. It's going pretty fast. I think that's how we really need it. Alright. Now, select your empty. Hit, uh, Add a sensor, controller, and two actuators. The sensor being always, and and, and the controller being and and the f the first actuator being edit object in add object. It's already on that. Now, before you do anything with add object, right there, go over to the always. Put the so Delay between the repeated pulses, and that's how much, yeah, that's the delay. You need to put that on one or two, otherwise there'll be a lot of them coming out at once, and your computer will freeze. Probably anyway, but you don't want it to get close to it either. So here, you type in sphere, because that's what we added in the, in the other tab. And the time is like milliseconds on both of these. So I'm going to set this one on 60 for one second. Now, uh, we can, like, minimize that. And motion, put it on rotation. So it looks like it's spiraling. Now, if you press P to play, you, I think I put it on the wrong rotation. Alright. Now, you can see it is spiraling and I will show you from a different view. It is spiraling and it's shooting out these little spheres that are deleting themselves after they've been out for uh like a second. And this is a good strategy for a first person shooter game or a like a game a game you can make a blender where you're like a a plane and you can like shoot bombs at people and all that. Now, so, thank you for watching this tutorial, and I will be seeing you on my next one.